come? Then I hear looks... about the machine in the old growth. You're going you... after that horror. I'm going to try. Nice stuff. Do you mind answering a couple of questions about it? I'll I'll tell you what I can. Tell me what happened, step by step. There were five of us hunting for boar to help feed the tribe. Just like I did we had drink done yesterday half a during dozen the times night, before. So I'm about to Some machines either. got in our way. Happens every time we go to the old growth. Like always, we cleared them out. But this time, when we were done. But I'm not really a big drinker. We heard this roar. Hey, easy. I saw a Although flash from I the trees. Be a bit of in the All claws thing, and tail. Pinching, it ripped right uh, through Cole and Re much. and Zan. Came expected. right at me. Slashed my uh, shoulder. Into your shower and there was blood. Your chill time then an arrow slammed romantic. into its neck. My Thank friend Lau. The BRB he distracted it. Along. Same yelled night. and whooped it. It turned on him. He disappeared into the trees, and it followed him. Last thing I, I heard him yell was for me to Bridgetons run. So Wednesday. I did. That's for sure. You won't see I me on I was halfway Wednesday. back to playing song before I realized what I had done. Left loud to die. Is there anything you can tell me about the machine that might help? It looked like a claw strider, but it was stronger. Much stronger. Anything else? Its armor was darker and it had a strange purple glow. Thanks. Mm. I think I know what I'm dealing with. Again, the strange purple glow. I need to glow. get going. That's you don't want to fight that thing. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. Well, if you do, I hope you cut it to shreds. It killed Lao, my oldest friend. Well, big ugly machine. Don't need to know more. I'm gonna glide off here, I think. Whee! I thought the land gods rejected us. Nice. Okay, so how how does this game work again? Hello. Got the pouch. But where are the other hunters? Strider that attacks them. I better check for tracks with my focus. Okay. There. Claw Strider tracks. I might have chased the other hunters deeper into the forest. Sweet. I think I will go try to take care. Another hunter. Claw Strider must have caught up to them. Okay, got the seat pouch. Better pick up the close rider's tracks and keep going. No. Why would you use that with them? Oh, that is an orange piece. Is this girl there? I'm sorry. And bones. I'm very sorry. The third hunter. Oh. I should collect their seat pouch. He died where the close rider caught him. 
At least I can return a seat pouch. Right, yep, yep. What stops that machine? I better scan for tracks. Sorry. Okay, three hunters. There should be one more. Closed Rider probably oh. chased after him. Yeah, but I don't see anything. Oh, through the water. There's some kind of residue here. from the closed rider. Maybe from a weapon? Hmm. Maybe the last one survived? Like the closed rider continued up the cliff. Wow, gave it quite the chase. The cliff's covered in gouge marks. The machine must have clawed its way up. Maybe our last person survived, hopefully. Oh my god. Okay. Let's jump. It would be nice if if that one last person would live at least. But that's a big Damn Looks that like machine was very aggressive. Here. Slowed it down. Oh, the hunter kept running. tracks in here and no sign of the last hunter either I don't know why these machines are watching that crack in the cliff better clear them out first I hate them these are the type of machines that I absolutely despise they are really annoying to kill Let's try this. What could go wrong, right? Oh, maybe they're not so annoying anymore? I got stronger, perhaps? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, I think they're still annoying. Oh god. Much better. Forgot how to dodge. Okay. The machines were interested in that crevice in the cliff. Wasn't too bad. Check it out. Gotta feel Lao was pretty resourceful. I still don't like them. Oh, maybe the last person went in there. 
Hopefully they survived. Never mind. Let's see what's in here. There are claw marks here for sure. Oh yes, let's go! They're gone? I wasn't expecting a rescue. Thank you, Outlander. I'm after the claw strider. Where did it go? You're hunting it? Yep. It's okay. I fought bigger. Who are you? Just stay here while I try to pick up its trail. I'll let you know when it's... I can handle it from here. Well, he came back. Oh no, this is the annoying one I hate. Never mind. Slow it down for you. Stay back and don't fire until I do. Watch for its claws. Killer machine. More deadly than the normal one. Holy cannoli, yeah, this is the one that I hate. Yeah, let's get rid of its there first. Oh boy. No ammo, what do you mean? Oh, I forgot to craft. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Oh god. I hate you. Okay, it wasn't that bad so far. Boy, oh boy. Nice. It's done. We did it. <laughs> I got a gold thingy. Yeah, this is the one that I hate. Not not the little big things. It's Lao, right? Ben thinks he left you for dead. He made it back. I was worried about him. He said you saved him by getting the claustrator to chase you. <laughs> and he saved me by sending you after me, so we're even. <laughs> I can't wait to see the look on his face when he figures out I'm alive. Go on back then. And thanks for the assist. Slowing that machine down helped. And here, take this. Oh? I can craft another one if I need it, but... Well, I hope I won't after this, Thank not for you, a while. I guess. Nice. One more hunter gets to go home. Now I just have to return the seed pouches to Shale. Oh. Oh. There's Shale. Oh, yeah, Now has come you. back to us thanks to you. Here. I like her head. The seed piece. pouches. I'll see that these are returned to their families for planting and remembrance. I'm sure Lau and Van would like to thank you in person. You can find them at the grove. It's been an honor, Aloy. May the land be kind to you. Hey, Katalo? I'm at the Zenith Lab. Ready to come over? I'm on my way. Aloy, I appreciate you meeting me here. I'm happy to help. Did Gaia mention where exactly in the Zenith lab we'd find what you need? She mentioned the chamber where you found Beta, and the 
database that lies within. She said it'll help us find the knowledge and components I require to build a new arm. That's gonna be pretty dope. We will have to be quick about it in case it's a robotic arm. Understood. I'm actually excited. The lab's up this way. Can he climb with one arm only though? How? 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 Oh. You okay? I got this. He's dope. Damn. Machines. We're scrapping the specters for parts. Oh, we harvest their face paint. One hand climbing. Oh, yes. Or we can sneak past them. Are you Nina? We're here. Now we just need to find a way to access the database guy was talking about. Varro mentioned you found Beta in one of those pods. I would hate to be locked up inside such a thing. There's barely room to breathe. I mean, she locked herself up in there, so... that I need to search. Oh my god, what code do I have to end? Why? Why is there a code here? Oh god. Um... I think I found what oh, we're looking for. Never mind. <laughs> Let's hope it holds the answers we seek. I'll download the database to your focus so you can search through it later. What about the components? They should be somewhere on the Spectres! For the fallen marshals! What? We'll have to finish them! What? What? What do you mean? Oh god, uh, I don't have any ammo. Uh, uh, oh god. And they need acid, I think. Okay, well, it's fine. It's not fine. Oh my god, let me- oh my god. I did not plan that, but sure. I will take it. Get one at a time. I know. Oh boy. Oh my god. I wanted to turn on my follower. Oh god. Die. I hate you. Die. Oh my god. Hello. Is one of them dead? Oh my. Oh no, you're still alive. I see. Oh boy. Oh, what the? Where am I? Oh, this is not a good place to be. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go, 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 let me go. Oh boy, chill out. Okay. Chill the fuck out. Why are you not dead yet? Okay, now the second one. Oh 
now we're not here to play around oh ouch I feel like I did a bit more damage with my arrows, but it will do. Die. Nice. The These guys are scary. We need to finish up and get out of here. The components should be somewhere on the second floor. I'm right behind you. Thanks for the loot. You. What are these particles? Um, I guess we're going this way. I knew that it's not gonna be this easy. <laughs> I think uh, there are gonna be more of them. We need to search the entire floor. I'll keep a lookout. Don't want any more surprises. Good idea. Uh. Let's stay with this weapon, but I do want. Oh boy. A vent. Might be a way out of this room. A vent? Oh. I have no idea where are we going. The components have to be here somewhere. I think it's right here. Or no. Oh. oh, I didn't even notice them. Let me scan this room just in case. But no one, not in here. Please tell me the components are in there. Right, open them. I should go back and nice. get these to Katalo. you buddy oh you found the components see for yourself you have my thanks Aloy something wrong I was just thinking about what it will be like after I build the arm will I feel different whole again <laughs> idle thoughts <laughs> they can wait until we're back at base you go on ahead I might want to take one more look around, in case there's anything useful. Very well. I look forward to putting what we found to good use. Walk with the it's, ten. That was easy. 
It was like 15 minutes. <laughs> I thought it was gonna take longer. Aloy, well met. We've been briefed on our mission and are ready whenever you wish to head to Cauldron Gemini. Were you able to finish the new arm Gaia was helping you with? Indeed. I was hoping we could discuss it, yeah. if you have a moment. You wanted to talk about your arm? Indeed. It's time to test it. And I want you to be there. Okay. How are we doing this? Not how. Where. Will you meet me where we felled Regala's tremor tusk? Oh, okay. Right where the river well bends? Done. Sure, <laughs> if you want, but I'm not sure I understand. You'll see when we get there. I promise. Then I'll let you know when I get close. You have my thanks, Aloy. Have you spoken with Alva? The Quen is peculiar. Nothing like a Tanakh. Her mind is sharp. That much is certain. Hmm. But it's hard to imagine her surviving in the wilds. Trust me. I want to get the picture of she looks. I will take your word for it. Your studies going i wanted to learn more about the world of the old ones and i looked up this pharaoh gaia said you went looking for and learned about the plague of machines he unleashed to think that the ancient world was wiped out by <sighs> a mistake a single miscalculation that... there is no glory yep. or honor in such a fate only hubris and pointless death that about sums it up. I have to go now. Then do not let me keep you. <laughs> like I said, I'll call you when I'm close to Regala's old outpost near the bulwark. May the I really like this headpiece. It looks so fun. And now let's get to talk with everyone, I guess. Welcome back. Good to be back. Have you met our new Quen guest yet? I could barely keep up as she gave herself a tour of the base. Varro gave her a new focus. Though when he told her she was free to access all the data we had here, she turned so pale I, I thought she'd faint on the spot. <laughs> we showed her to the archive room so she could see for herself. She hasn't left the place since. Sounds like Alba. Oh, I also wanted to give you this. Oh? For helping with the land gods. Plain song is in your debt. Thank you, Zo. You deserve much more for all you've done. May the land always bloom in your steps. And yours? Not awkward. Read anything interesting lately? I found out the old ones use leaf infusions like the Utaru do. Tea, they call it. Apparently it helped soothe them. That and some sort of scented wax they used to cleanse their aura, uh, plus something called bubble baths. <laughs> Me, I think I'll stick to singing to calm the nerves. <laughs> How to go with the chorus after we fix the land gods? They were shocked when I told them that our lands would soon be on the mend. I thought Fane's eyes would pop out of his head. But of course they had no choice but to take it as good news. Even if it meant all their preaching about meekly accepting our doom was exposed as rot. To be honest, I found the conversation to be highly enjoyable. I'm glad. You deserve it. They're lucky that you never gave up on saving them. How are things with everyone? Slightly quieter. Aaron's been busy scouring data on his newest obsession. Apparently, the old ones wrestled machines as some kind of performance. Called it metal versus meat. A must-see battle between steel and flesh, as Aaron likes oh. to put it. You'd think we have enough of that going around as it is. I need to get going. Right. You've retrieved the Omega clearance. That means we'll be going after Hephaestus soon. I'll make sure my gear's ready. Yeah, that's why I want to do as many side quests as I can. From the look on your face, I'd say the mission was a success. I got Omega Clarence. Is everyone ready to head out to Cauldron Gemini? As soon as you give the word. 
Did Alva make it here all right? Our new Quen friend. <laughs> the moment she laid eyes on the archives, she jumped on them like a long leg. Sounds about right. Now that I have Omega clearance, we can grab Hephaestus and finally have the advantage over the Zeniths. Can't wait to see their faces as they stare down a bunch of charging thunder jaws. Better them than us, for once. Once Gaia is back up and running, I expect you to put all your training to good use. The seeds have been planted. All they need is a chance to bloom. Oh my god, what? <laughs> what? I thought that was pretty good. Zo liked it. I'm oh. glad you and Zo found each other. Don't forget, you're to blame for that. How's everyone feeling? Everyone's curious about all Very that. poetic. It's amazing to think there's an entire tribe across the great waters who've been using focuses for longer than I've been alive. Zoe's been trying to get Alver to run her through Quen history, but she seems a bit shy around her. From what I gather, the Quen get punished if they share data. She just needs some time to get used to us. Makes sense. We'll give her some space. I never thanked you for helping Zoe fix her land gods. They mean so much to her. When we met Zo, the Utaru wouldn't even listen to her. And now look what she's done for them. With your help, of course. I know what it's like to be ignored by an entire tribe. One day I hope the Nora can make up for that mistake. In the meantime, though, you're stuck with me. Mm. I don't mind the part. I should go get this to Gaia. Of course. Let us know when we're needed. There she is. Heard you had an interesting time at Thebes. Maniacs, lava, what's not to like? I'll remember that next time I go traveling. At least I got what we needed to trap Hephaestus. Good thing I got my gear ready then. I found out who's running the Sons of Prometheus. A woman named Asera. Oh, All no. right, yes. Remember how Durval had a band of freebooters that retaliated against the Karja? She was one of them. First female uh. tinker in the claim to run her own forge. But when okay. her family got killed in the Red Raids, she went bad. Real bad. I thought she was dead, though. Taken out by one of Murad's guys. Well, she's not. And she wants revenge against the Karja. We have to find out where she's operating from and stop her. I haven't had any luck finding someone with a focus at Chain Scrape, so I'll be scouting out Baron Light next. I'll keep tracking her lackeys out west. <laughs> we'll find her. We have to. It's thugs like her who murdered my sister. You look tired. Ha! You're never one to hold back, are you? <laughs> I've just been making sure that well, I got everything I'm just honest. down for this mission of yours. I don't want to be the usual screw-up out there. He'll do fine, Erend. Have you spoken with Alva yet? Yeah, when she's not reading the archives like a giddy kid drinking her first ale. Uh, she took to that new focus quick, that's for sure. I gotta say, I'm a little jealous. But I can see why you two hit it off. Okay. I should get going. As soon as you want us heading out to those cauldrons. I'll give you the heads up. Now, I have no idea where the archive on. Uh... Did okay, see one of my machine strike pieces around? Why don't you check the cache? Maybe you left it there when you dropped off all that ale. Oh. Oh, she's here. What's hot? Aloy! Right to work, I see. There's just so much. Mm. I mean, we knew of artificial beings that served the ancestors, but Gaia? Oh, she's amazing! A and you, a true. <laughs> she's so excited. Of an ancestor. Genetically speaking, of course, not like the um, late CEO. And there's more ancestors out there. Returned from beyond the stars. 
Of course, they're trying to kill us, which is not great. And Eric Visser is with them, which is disturbing. And then there's Hephaestus, and... Okay, okay. How about we take it one step at a time? You're right. <laughs> I also owe you an explanation for everything that happened at Landfall. You said you owed me an explanation for what happened in Thebes. I'm listening. Right. This is gonna and be I'll interesting. Start at the beginning with the CO. He was an Imperial, the Emperor's nephew, in fact. As such, he sponsored many diviners to search the legacy for anything that might help the tribe and himself. He took a special interest in anything related to Ted Farrow, whom we consider the greatest of the ancestors. Ted Farrow, revered ancestor. That's tough to take. I know better now, of course. Anyway, the Diviners discovered that Pharaoh spent a great deal of time in San Francisco. In fact, many of the most important ancestors did. So the Emperor's nephew convinced him that an expedition across the ocean might solve our most pressing problems. If only we could find the right data in this fabled city. Perhaps we could roll back the floods and storms that threatened our people. The Emperor declared that all the tribe's resources be poured into this endeavor. Dozens of ships were built, scouting missions were dispatched, and the Emperor's nephew was named Sio, one who wields the legacy for the good of the Empire. The living embodiment of Ted Pharaoh, a renewer. It may seem strange now, but for a time, he carried all of our hopes. We really believed he would save us. We had no idea just how perilous the journey would be. Hmm. Back at the greenhouse, you spoke of knowledge forbidden to your people. Diviners are meant to seek out the truth in the legacy. And many Imperials sponsor them in the hopes they'll find something the Empire can put to use, thus gaining favor with the Emperor. But the Board of Overseers claims certain truths are detrimental to the stability of the Empire. Like discovering one of our revered ancestors ended the world. That is why oh, the oh, yeah. are only allowed to access segments of the legacy. Only overseers can view it all. It ensures that any heretical data can be contained and retrieved before it can spread. What happens to diviners who break the rules? I never had the courage to ask. Nothing good, most likely. The ancestors. Is that what your people call the old ones? Yes and no. The ancestors are the greatest of the old ones. Those whose legacy taught us agriculture, medicine, warfare, leadership, and patronage of the science and arts. The CEO called Elizabeth Sobek an assistant. What's that about? Right. Well, any old one who has made minor contributions or worked extensively under one of the ancestors is called an assistant. That's how we thought of Sobek until we met you. Our limited access to data past the late 2040s has obviously uh, misinformed our view of the past. Hmm. You mentioned the reason you came here was to help your family. Your sister... Her name is Alika. Our parents are commoners. Peasants, really. When I passed the divination exams, they were so proud. It brought honor to our family and increased rations. Only Alika begged me not to leave for the research academy. Why? What happens there? Alika knew that once you enter, you're not allowed to leave or see anyone, not even your family, uh, unless you can get special permission and an escort by an overseer. That sounds harsh. Like the focuses we keep, diviners are few in number and the empire is, well, fearful that outsiders will try to steal our knowledge. Last time I was allowed to see my family was just before our voyage here. Because of my position, I was able to get them refuge from the floods within the capital. But if our crops don't recover soon, they'll starve to death along with everyone else. Oh, no. I promise I'll do my best to make sure it doesn't come to that. Yeah. 
You said the expedition across the sea was more dangerous than you thought it would be. What happened? We lost most of our ships to hurricanes, and scores of soldiers perished to hunger and disease. <laughs> yes, Raven. And that was before Hello. we even hit the coast. Once we landed, you? machines ripped our patrols apart, and we struggled to replenish our rations. There were bright spots, not, to not be sure. For too long we found today. Thebes and the greenhouse, but nothing improved the CEO's mood as his dreams of saving the tribe were slowly dashed. He became more and more obsessed with Thebes and what lay behind its door, and more and more convinced that the title of CEO was no mere honorific. You heard him spouting nonsense about Pharaoh's essence and some kind of becoming. We knew these weren't the words of a sane man, but he was quick to put any who spoke out in front of a firing squad. What a great guy. The Quen are wrong about many things when it comes to the legacy. I can see that now. But what the CEO became was a complete perversion of what principal diviners stand for. The pursuit of truth. Hydrate, you sorry bastard! Hydrate! I had to endure his madness. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm just glad it's over. Did you have for dinner and hope that you enjoyed it? I would drink more. Oh, hi, your overseer. Will he run things better than CEO? He won't execute people on a whim, if that's what you mean. But he's hardly a paragon of integrity. I can't tell you how many times he took credit for data in the legacy that I uncovered. The best thing I can say about him is that he can be trusted to always do what's best for him. <laughs> Sounds about right. Uh, this is promising. Oh, so many things cracking. Oh. Uh. It was good, thank you. I had fish. That's nice. You mentioned Eric mm -hmm. Visser. How do you know about him? The Zenith who tried to kill you? He is known to the Quen as the Protector. Combing through data related to his work led us to breakthroughs related to weapons and military tactics. Knowledge our rulers use to conquer and expand, to become the empire we are today. That's why he's one of our most revered ancestors. Mm. But based on your encounter with him, it appears he's even more Welcome ruthless back, than Ellie. we ever imagined. We had a good dinner. Yet another distorted interpretation in the legacy. Well. At least you're piecing together the truth. If only the overseers back home would do the same. Beta mentioned other Zenas. Tilda, Verbena, and Gerard. I'm afraid I don't know anything about them. Whatever legacy they left behind, the Diviners haven't recovered. I imagine you don't know anyone here that well yet, but they're a good group. It's funny because one of your friends is, well, another you. <laughs> yes, so that's that you true. Are the same person at all. I mean, we just look you the are, same. as in, you're both genetically Elizabeth Sobek, but even so, you're different. Yeah. You will miss the end of your stream, maybe I was there, but I missed it. <laughs> yeah, I, I missed the beginning. I was there a little bit in the middle, and I missed the end. I mean, I was kind of there at the end, but yeah. I hope everyone's been treating you okay. I slept oh, in. Yeah, of course. I was supposed to wake They've up so much earlier than I did. But and it is what it is. Share the knowledge they learn on their focuses with each other freely. It's refreshing. Back home, diviners can only share data with the permission from the overseers. Sounds restrictive and stifling. Yeah, you are not wrong. <laughs> I see you've been using your new focus. It's been fascinating. So much better than the version the Quen have. What would have taken me years to sort through, like the database you helped me recover? With this, I've been able to establish search parameters to speed up the process. This could revolutionize how diviners analyze the legacy. That is, whatever part of it the overseers would actually let us study. Well, maybe you should just stay here and study everything. You data, you'll find lots of it here. A diviner has never had this sort of unsupervised access to archives such as this. And knowing you, I suspect there is much that would normally be forbidden held within them. 
but I was sent here to help you. I would be remiss to ignore any truth laid before me. Maybe it'll help the Quen find their way back to the path of truth. I highly doubt that, but... I need to get going, but if you need anything... All I need is to help you succeed in your mission. The plan Gaia told me about to capture Hephaestus, it will help set things right. I hope so. Then I will do whatever I can. I promise. I kinda like her, I'm just a bit worried when she has to go back to her land. Sure, this is what Katala wanted us to test his new arm. Sure, but he hasn't mind, though. We should contact him. Let him know I'm here. Hey, Katalo. Yeah. I'm by the Tremor Tusk site where we agreed to meet. Want to test that new arm of yours? I'll be there shortly. Hey, let's see. Did he like equip it already? Thank you for Not waiting. yet. Maybe now you can tell me what we're doing here? Not just yet. Oh. Follow me, please. Okay. Someone's being awfully mysterious. <laughs> you took your sweet time telling me what you wanted to do to the bulwark. Consider this my revenge. Fair enough. Okay. I kind of like him. I wouldn't mind if I look at romancing. This is it. Oh, what am I looking at? Oh, you'll see. Come. All right, what are we looking at? I wish to test the arm on that. It has masked the valley for some time. Killed more than a few of the Sky Clan. But no longer. And where is your arm? <laughs> I'm honored to help. Oh. Whoa, that's so cool. Oh, he's missing a finger. After you. That's so cool. Let's okay. see how this thing likes the taste of metal. Did I ever scan this beast? No. It doesn't like... Oh. It doesn't like... Um... What is this? That was great. Um, Mr. Coolio, yes. Kinda like him. He's growing on me. Oh, big kitty, leave me alone. Oh my god. Mmm, I think my dog just farted. Mmm. Mmm. Smells nice. Well, I think it's safe to say the new arm works fine. Agreed. Then why are you taking it off? This is what I am now. What I overcame. Anything else feels... wrong. Like a disguise. I understand that. 
when I need it. But the rest of the time, I will simply be myself. I wouldn't have it any other way. You have my thanks for doing this with me. Here. Something to mark our victory. Thank you. I'll see you later then. Pretend be with you, Aloy. And they're kind of enemies and such. Ada. So. Nilo. Did she say Nilo? Oh. Oh. You see that? Are you Nilo? Uh, hi there. No, you're not. Nora, here. You're a long way from home. I suppose I am. I'm looking for an herbalist named Nilo. I think I heard you say his name. You've come to the right place. His seeds were buried here, where he tended the blooms of others, including my mother's. I'm his daughter, Gia. How long has he been gone? Some five years now. Oh. He put a lot of love into this grove. Almost as much as he gave me. That's why I could never abandon River Him. I'd like to leave some flowers, if I may, from an old friend of his. <laughs> Scarlet stems. They're rare in these parts, but they were his favorite. I never knew why. He planted them whenever he could, but never picked them. Oh. Prefer to just watch them bloom. Sounds about right. So he was a good man who led a full life? He was. And he did. I don't know who this old friend is, but if my father liked them, they must be a good soul. That's kind of sad. I will be have I have to unlock something which Look, I didn't do yet. Lander's back. I can still see well enough, girl. <laughs> oh yeah, I think Is that's my long vigil over. You have word from my grandmother's gardener? Oh, yeah. yes and no. I laid the scarlet stems at his grave. His favorite flower. According to his daughter, always loved to watch them bloom. He's gone. But he did think of me over the years. That'll have to be enough. Really? That's it? Are you sure you got the right guard? Uh, herbalist? Huh. Seemed like you thought it was a fool's errand. Well... It's just that it meant something to you. It could have been a whole other life. Could have been. But this life hasn't turned out so bad. I even have a <laughs> granddaughter who cares enough to come looking for me out in the wilds. And I've still got scarlet stems to remind me of Nilo. Sounds like your grandmother's got it all figured out. Maybe she does. Just tell me the next time you want to come out here, okay? Instead of disappearing? Maybe I will. Here, Outlander. <laughs> Take this. For helping an old woman to remember she was once young. It's lucky for me that you're here, Outlander. The name's Jax. A squad of Tanakhs hold up in that cave. I think they're in trouble. At least one of them is injured. I'm here to offer help, but with the Tanakh, such an offer might be perceived as an insult even when help is needed. Will you stand with me? I saw you speak before the chorus, so I know you can be persuasive. And if things get out of hand, I will be stronger with your spear at my side. I'll do what I can. You there! This camp belongs to Eagle Squad. Retreat or die. At ease, Eagle. I'm not here for blood. Just to parlay. You know the parlay sign? Let us in so we can talk. It's pretty. So far, so good. Long way 
from the desert, aren't we? This one was blinded? Boy, nothing gets by you. Looks like your training mission didn't go according to plan. Huh? We're here to help. If you want it. How does an Utaro know we're on a training mission? He knew how to request a parlay, too. Oh, you see. He's not Utaro. Or Tenax. He must be a veteran. A veteran? I didn't think there were any left. We don't need help from a washed out farmer. Could have fooled me, judging by the look of things. The frame Sister, rate is killing me. It sounds like they just want to help us. Why not let them? What have we got to lose? What does it mean to be a veteran? I was born to Nock, but offered to Utaro in exchange for tribute. Tribute? Back when there was plenty, the Utaru offer yearly gifts of food to the Tanak to keep peace between them. Over time, this tribute grew into an exchange of people. The Tanak needed able-bodied youth to fight their clan battles. And the Utaru needed veteran soldiers to train the defenders of Plainsong. I was just such a soldier. Was being the key word. You may yet need my spear, young warrior. Hmm. You said you're on a training mission? A machine hunt. The final test before a young squad goes on active duty. Everything was going fine. We tracked a claw strider and hit it hard, but it fled into a herd of bristlebacks. One charge right at Kore. He dodged just in time and landed a strike as it passed. I hit an acid canister. The spray was like fire in my eyes. Oh no. A terrible wound. I should have scouted ahead. Spotted the herd. No. I should have spotted that canister. What do you need? Supplies. Dried meat, ammunition, weapons, camping equipment. A lot of provisions for a trip back to the desert. Everything we need is at River Watch. A huge cache of war spoils up there, left over from the route. The route? When our forces drove the Karja back to Baron Light, they made sure the Kestrels felt the loss, made it hurt. Marshal Canera shot a score of fleeing Karja from the top of River Watch, and her squad gathered the loot. It's all just sitting up there. Ours for the taking. Deadly machines are known to patrol that place, and the ruin itself is on the brink of collapse. You think machines and rotting ruins are enough to keep out Eagle Squad? No, but your injuries are. Let Jax and I grab these supplies for you. This is our mission. I'm not handing it over to some... Fine. Come with us. Fine. The three of you, hold position. I'll be back. Be safe, sister. Poor guy, that's not gonna heal up. That frame rate was crazy bad. The ruin is this way. Once we get those supplies, everything will be fine. So you say. What's that supposed to mean? Your brother's condition is... That's not your problem, farmer. So you say. Stop saying that. <laughs> hey, calm down. We're trying to help, remember? So you say. Oh boy, he's just trying to help. We'll have to cut across the river. Avoid the island oh. camp down the road. Something wrong? I hate getting wet. Tough as a ravager, this one. I heard that. A lot of machines and things and shit like that in the water. Hello. Oop. <laughs> Oh, 
we're here. The entrance should be right under that arch. Seems blocked to me. Blocked. Not getting in that way. Oh, would you look at that? some kind of basement gotta find a way up nice fresh line where is it coming from hmm I don't like the fact that I can pick up some mushrooms here because that means that we're gonna have a problem soon Should be at the top of the temple. But how to get up there? Let's clear this up. Is it lagging so badly now? <laughs> oh, how did I do then? I have no idea. Small cash. Can't be the supplies Sakura wanted. Better keep looking. If I fall down, I don't have to go up all the way. Oh god. I know ominous music. No, that's a. I can't leave that kid alone for a second. Kind of. What the Jackson's heck? Since the corner are in trouble. I got. I gotta 
get in there and take down those machines. Yes, yes. Hello, Mr. Hippo. Oh my god, jeez. Uh, How do you even have so many rocks in your belly or whatever you store it? Check on Jax and Sakura. They're fine. Let's see. What are you well, gonna be careful about? Though I would have preferred if you hadn't taunted that thing. What did you find? Uh, practically nothing. Sakura, there's maybe a day's worth of food here and some rotting medicinal herbs. There was supposed to be more. Enough for... It was never your intention to go home, was it? What do you mean? A blind Tanakh can't fight. And if you can't fight... The Tanakhs will kill Korra from being blind? He'll face a trial against the machine. They say it's more dignified that way. But it's still a death sentence. So you were gonna use the extra supplies to live in the wilds? I thought it would be enough to get us started. Can't they stay in Plainsong? For Tanakh? The Korras would never allow it. We should get back. I'll take this young sprout back. Meet us at the cave when you can. Hmm. They should be able to stay there though. I mean, he's blind, but... With some time, I'm sure he could learn to do some basic things. I think... no, that's for sure. supposed to tell them when I failed. Speak the truth. Plain and simple. Aloy, we were just about to head in. So what will you tell them? That we'll have to make do. Survive in the wilds without the supplies. That will be a hard life. Better than letting Cory be killed if we go back. There must be another way. I don't see one. So... We're all stocked up then? The cache was empty. But we'll be alright without them. I can't let you starve out here. Just leave me. No! Jax, you said Plainsong has too many mouths to feed to take them all in, but what about just. I am not leaving my brother behind. 
He'll be safe in Plainsong. And the rest of you can head home. It's the only real solution you've got. The I mean, the, yeah. Uh... But if I vouch for the board, I could convince them. I will do so if Korra wishes. No! You're not taking him! Sakura. I think this is oh. the best option. I'm a burden to you out here. This is what I want. Let me go with him. Permission granted. But brother, this is not the end for us. I will visit you in Plainsong, and no Utaru or Tanakh can stop me. They will be foolish to try. I'll stay and help them pack their gear, then take Korra back with me. You've shown strength and wisdom today. Rare combination. You have my thanks and theirs too, I'm sure. Honestly, all these side quests seems like more tragic and sad than the main quest. Oh, it's Sakura. Wasn't expecting to see you in Scalding Spear. I hear you fixed the wound. And stopped the war within our clan. I was just lucky your commander was willing to listen. Wasn't luck that took down the bulwark. Or fought off Regala. What's next? Saving the world? Yeah, pretty much. Sums it up. Um, have you been to Plainsong? Did you see Corey? I haven't had the chance. Oh. At the ready, soldier. What's going on? My squad's being sent on patrol northwest of here. I won't be able to see Corey for a long time. I wonder. If you could let him know, I don't want him to think I've abandoned him. We are moving out. Please. Yeah, if yeah, I yeah. I get to plain song. I'll let him know. Sakura, I will leave your scab ass behind. Thank you, Aloy. 